Hello everyone, welcome to Chart Train. Today we're going to talk about the cup and handle pattern. So sit back and relax, take some notes, and let's get started. Now the cup and handle pattern is really just a, a continuation pattern. This is the classic uh, trading chart pattern that's most commonly known in the markets. Um, it was discovered and defined by William O'Neill. Um, so more information can be found in his book, How to Make Money in Stocks. But we also teach the cup and handle pattern in our day trading and swing trading courses at TraderTrainingHQ.com. Now, this pattern typically has a run up on the left side. So you'll see a run up to a peak and then it's followed by a retracement back down that creates a cup like bottom. Um, now this bottom will dip about 15 to 20 percent from the peak. So from the top here to the bottom of the cup is 15 to about 35 percent. As you can see the bottom retracement took uh, let's see one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen weeks to retrace back up to a peak. And usually you'll see it's about even with the prior peak. So here's a look at NHTC. Now this is on a daily chart and the length of the cup should be at least seven weeks. So from this peak to this peak, a minimum of seven weeks. Although it can vary, um, usually the longer the better. Uh, once the right side of the peak, um, it will consolidate and it will form the handle of the cup. Now the handle should pull back anywhere from 10 to 15% from the peak. So from the top here to the bottom should be about 10 to 15 percent. At this point, a trader should watch for above average volume. So you want to look down here and you want to see usually a large amount of volume comes in. At that point, you want to enter the trade. Another way to enter the trade is to set a stop order that's 10 cents above the peak. So at the right hand handle or the peak of the handle, you want to enter the stock, but only if the volume is above average. So let's recap the cup and handle pattern. The prior uptrend should be of at least 30%. Retracement depth of 15 to 30% from the peak to the bottom of the cup. There should be a retracement period of at least seven weeks long. So from peak to peak should be at least a minimum of seven weeks. It should be a nice U-shaped pattern. And the handle should form and pull back 10 to 15% from that right hand peak. You should enter a buy point of 10 cents above the peak and the breakout should occur on above average volume. So there you have it, a cup and handle base. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure you like it. And if you really enjoyed it, share it with someone. If you'd like to know more about chart and patterns and how to swing trade, visit our site at tradertraining.com. My name is Brad McMahon. Until next time, go forth and trade well.